Hey, what's going on, YouTubers? Uh, it's Dino400. I'm going to show you 25 games in my NES collection. I was going to do it 50, but I ran out of time when I did it. So, anyway, 50, there are 25 games. So, I'm going to start off. Um, I got the, uh, the original Mario Brothers arcade game. Um, it's cool. It's a, it's a good port. Um, then I got uh, Super Mario Brothers and Duck Hunt Combo. Which is classic, like everybody had that game. You get to use the zapper for the duck hunt and awesome game. Then we got Super Mario Brothers 2, which was originally Doki Doki Panic or some shit, some crazy shit. But uh, anyway, they just made it a Mario 2 game and it's a good game. I still love this game. Uh, Super Mario Brothers 3, which they made a movie called The Wizard that was like a marketing ploy for this game. It's got Fred Savage in it from the one of years. Then I got Dr. Mario, which is a good puzzle game. Um, you're taking a bunch of pills or something. I don't know. It's a cool game. <laughs> and then next, um, got some Simpsons games. Simpsons Bart vs. the World. It was hard as shit. All the Simpsons games are pretty hard. Um, they got Simpsons Bart vs. the Space Mutants. This is one where, like, the first level, you go around painting everything that's purple or covering it up, and the second level is, like, fucking taking hats. It's a crazy plot for a game, but it's, it's still cool. I like it. All right, then we got uh, the last Bart one is the Bartman Meets Radioactive Man. Um, this is probably the best out of the Bart games. You get to actually, like, shoot shit with lasers, and I don't know. That's cool. I like it. Then my last Simpsons game I have is Krusty's Fun House, which uh, it's like a puzzle game where you try to get mice into a machine that Bart or Homer, whoever's controlling. And uh, I haven't got super far in it. My girlfriend's pretty good at it. All right, then I got um, Mega Man 3, which is one of my favorite Mega Mans. Mega Man 2 and 3 are the best. Uh, not kind of as cool as music is the second one. All right, next I got... Uh, Batman, the video game, motherfucker. <laughs> um, this was the, like the first game, I guess. And uh, it's really fun. It's really hard after like the third level or whatever. But uh, it's cool. Batman Returns. This game wasn't as good as the first one. Um, the Super Nintendo version of this is the shit. It's like really good graphics and it's way better. But the NES version is still cool. You uh, can go up and down and shit. You don't have to just go side to side like a regular side scroller. Then I got Narc, the anti drug game that was used to be an arcade game. You just go around shooting crackheads and uh, <laughs> stupid shit. I don't know, cleaning up the streets, man. You pick up cocaine bags and money and you can arrest people. Then they made a remake where you can like take acid and all kinds of shit for Xbox. Then I got Gradius, which is like. Uh, the best, one of my favorite, well, I think the best, the uh, best shooter, like airplane shooter. Um, then they made a third one for the Super, it's really good. And then, of course, Legend of Zelda. Badass game. Then I got, um, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the first one. Yeah, they all got fucking red masks for some reason. <laughs> They're all Raphael's. It's a good game, it's really hard, though. Then I got, this one's even better, Turtles 2, the arcade game. The arcade game was the shit. It was a good two-player game. Um, yeah. <laughs> Turtles 3, the Manhattan Project. It's pretty much like the second one. It's just different levels, different bosses and shit. I like this game a lot, though. It's bad. Uh, we got the Uncanny X-Men. This game's not so cool. <laughs> it's it's X-Men, but it's hard, and it's, I don't know, it's not that cool. But, uh, gotta love the X-Men, so. There's another NES game called Wolverine I want to get. Uh, Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. Yeah, I did. Uh, this game's kind of crazy. You have to go through time and shit in your, uh, phone booth. And, I don't know, it's cool, though. I just haven't got too far in it. Check that game out. Alright, then I got fucking Metroid. I got the cool cover one, not the shitty one. And I got Monster Party Whoa! This game's cool. I like it. It's got crazy dialogue. Um, it's 
got a weird story. It's just a bunch of monsters. You go and fight like all these bosses, get keys or something. I like this game. It's got a cool Halloween feel to it. Then I got a uh, Gunsmoke, which is like one of my favorite NES games. You go around shooting Indians and shit, cool bosses. Get machine guns, uh, shotguns, magnums, a horse. I don't know, it's pretty sweet. Then we got Friday the 13th. Fucking Jason. Jason purple in this game. It's hilarious. <laughs> You gotta get it. It's not that good of a game, but I like I like to play it. It's still fun. Your camp counselors and you have like six of them, and you go around trying to save kids and shit. It's weird because Jason never kills kids. Uh, then I got Last a Nightmare on Elm Street, Freddy Krueger. This one's better than the Jason game, but it's kind of stupid that uh, you just punch snakes and bats and stuff. Uh, there's no like real crazy monsters, but you get to fight his uh, bosses are just like different card like, different versions of him. But yeah, anyway, that's my 25 games. I'm going to do another 25. Uh, do some Sega Genesis games after that. But anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.